Okay guys, let's say you just got some batteries in from Hobby King and it's got these crazy giant gauge wires uh, attached to the battery pack and you need to put on your XT60. What are you going to do? Um, it's going to show you a way of getting around uh, putting larger wires into the XT XT60 because as we know these are set up for a smaller gauge wire. So you're going to need obviously your heat shrink tubing and um, I've already done this uh, one right here and I'll show you exactly what I did. So I'll put that aside. So this is the uh, the, the fender here. So I'm going to shorten this, these leads at the same time. So right to about there. And these are so... First thing we're going to do is just cut one wire at a time. Be safe, guys. Uh, you never do two wires at the same time because if they touch, then you are um, probably out of some fingers and out of a battery. So go ahead and um, peel back. Um, this is about two and a half millimeters or so. Okay, so what I'm going to do at this point is I'm going to have my wire cutter and I'm going to take off about one third, one third of this uh, amount of wire here. So which is going to be, let's so take, take my fingernail and take off about that much, which is going to lessen the diameter of the wires that we're going to tin up and solder. Cut this off camera here. And what that leaves is about that much wire, which is really pretty cool. We're going to twist that and we'll get that tinned up. Okay guys, uh, go, let's go ahead and put our um, heat shrink tubing over the red lead here. And I'm going to make sure that my positive is up, and it is. Okay, let me go ahead and heat up this just a smidge, get that melting, and uh, we'll get these two guys here. We'll set that right there. And then go ahead and crush it and press it in. And you'll see it all get molten, and I'm pushing the red wire in a little bit. And there's a perfect pool of solder there. Slide this up right all the way over that connection. Okay, we're gonna flip this over. So this is how you deal with those giant wires that you can't solder into the XT60s. I don't know if anyone else does it this way. This is the way I do it. There we go, there's a perfect solder joint right there. That's how you deal with the, the large giant battery pack uh, wires from the Hobby King that they always do. And this is my new uh, Zippy Compact 2450. This is a 4S and this is going to go into my legit wing. Got it right over here and we'll get this uh, heated up here. Okay, there we go. Guys, thanks for joining my channel and I'll talk to you later. Bye.